I think you do me heart is. It's just me, Scotty McClure. I thought I'd, I'd just pop up and say hi to every single one of you because it's been some time since we were live on Facebook and it's only fair. Everybody's been asking, Scotty, where are you and when are you coming to join us, etc., etc. And I thought... I'll pop up and just say hi to everybody on Facebook and see that everything's going well for them. So welcome, welcome, welcome. Lovely to have you with us, of course, and dinky-doo from me, Scotty McClue. It's been some time since we popped up on Facebook Live, but of course there's lots and lots happening, so a very, very warm welcome to you. And of course, pass the word on, share it, and tell 10 to tell 10 that Scotty McClue has popped up live to say hi to you on Facebook. Do feel free to come and join us, of course. Lovely to have you with us and a very, very warm welcome. Tremendous. Take the banner off Alan McKee. What kind of ridiculous thing to say. Dinky do the wonderful Gordon Roddick has joined us. Welcome, welcome. Lovely to see you, Gordon, and thanks for coming and joining us. Um, it's been some time since we popped up together on Facebook, and I thought to myself, I think it was the last lockdown that uh, we were doing the big pop-ups. Hello, Tony. Dinky do. And uh, welcome, welcome. Lovely to have you all with me tonight. Uh, just to say hi, to touch base with you, see how you're all keeping tremendous stuff. There's Jim. Dinky do. Jim, thank you very much. David's watching. Lovely, lovely, lovely. When are you back on the airwaves? Well, I think COVID is holding things up at the moment. Hi, Scotty, says Albert. Dinky do, Albert. Lovely to have you with us. And Dinky do as well. Uh, Scotty, Dinky do, says David. There's Louise. Louise Arnold, Dinky do. Paddy McPhee, excellent. Lovely to have you with us. And welcome, welcome, welcome. Now, <coughs> so much happening, of course. Um, we've been doing a lot of lives on TikTok, so if any of you are into TikTok, then please feel free to join me at 9 p.m. every night at Scotty McClue. So there we are, capital S, small c, O double T I E. That's the Scotty and the McClue, capital M, small c, capital C L U E. So there you are. Come and join me at 9 o'clock, and then we also will be uploading that to the Scotty McClue YouTube channel. Feel free to get on to that as well. Just put in Scotty McClue YouTube channel. There's no point in me giving you all these uh, URLs and things like that. But uh, do follow me and, of course, follow Scotty McClue live here on Facebook. So that's the housekeeping up to date. Now I need to know how you're all doing. Dinky do good man, Brian Hall. Lovely to have you with us. Dinky do from Blackpool, Alan and son Alfie and daughter Alicia. Alan, welcome from Blackpool. Poor old Blackpool at the moment. You're all having a very, very tough time. And the news is so depressing, I thought we'll not mention any depressing things on here. So there you are. Tony says, I can't get TikTok to work. It won't take my date of birth. It should go back to the last century, Tony. There shouldn't be a problem on that. See how you get on. I mean, if, it, if I can get on to TikTok, then you can get on to TikTok. And uh, Louise says, I've been streaming on Twitch and I made soup today on TV. Congratulations, Louise, because that, and Gordon Roddick will back me up here, that's not as easy as it might seem. One of the reasons I'm not working full-time in television at the moment is because I'm not a very good cook. If I could cook, I would have my own show right away. If I spoke fluent Gaelic, I would have my own show right away. And Lou Grade, yes, uh, somebody said if Lou Grade had been alive today, Scotty McClure would never be off our television screens. How about that? So dinky do. In fact, I was thinking, God, and this will make you smile. I was thinking of contacting some of the big news providers and saying, look, um, give me uh, some news to read and I'll read it for you because some of the news readers we're getting at the moment, they're dreadful. I don't know if you saw me posting that they all begin, well... Well, and what is this? Well, so there we are. They say now it's over to our reporter Scotty McClure. Scotty, 
Well, you see, and I thought, just go straight in. If you all stop welling, you might, welling, see what I just did there. If you stop welling, you might get another story in the bulletin. So there you are. The wonderful Nikki Graham's joined us. Listened to you since the 1990s, says Mark. Thank you, Mark. Very much appreciated. Scotty, missed the start. What's happening with Ocean Radio? Well, we haven't heard, I think, COVID is holding things up at the moment, but I will keep you all informed. Mark says, if I can get a word in edgeways. Mark, why would you want to put a word in edgeways? Put it in front ways. There you are. Uh, my first Friday night sober. I'm staying sober for March to raise money for the Macmillan Cancer Trust. Tony, well done. Uh, McClure hasn't had any alcohol for about, I don't know if it's six or seven years. It's knocking on a bit anyway. What about the FM? Didn't she do well? She did very well. Gordon Riley, we'll see what happens. Provost Henry, dinky do, lovely to have you with us. And a very, very warm welcome. LMAO says Mark. Absolutely, yes. You don't need to get a word in edgeways with McClure. You just... Put your hand up. Have you not been on Zoom and Teams and all these wonderful platforms recently where everybody has meetings? You put your hand up. I can remember going on a Radio 4 program um, with the wonderful lady uh, that did... Uh, oh, you've never stopped being funny. Mark, you're very, very kind. You're one of the few people who thinks Scotty McClure's funny, <laughs> including close family. There we are. Uh, isn't it interesting that if you enjoy talking, people tell you to be quiet all the time? You know, it's very strange. You're giving people wisdom and they go, oh, shut up. <laughs> <laughs> Very strange. Brilliant first time I caught you live. Albert, excellent. Good for you, dinky do. We haven't been live on Facebook, in fairness, for a while. Uh, so there we go. What about the Duke? He's not doing so well. Well, he's doing very well for almost a 100. So there you are. So let's see. I mean, Gordon, how will you be doing, you know, a month or two before your hundredth birthday? You know, three three months, I think. Is that right? This is March. March to April, one April to May, two May to June, three. Yeah, just over three months till your hundredth birthday, 12 weeks. So what to do, Mark? Come on 12 weeks before your hundredth birthday and tell us all how you're looking and sounding. There we are. So true, says Louise. There we are. I couldn't be a stand-up comic. I'd have to sit down. Well, as you know, Tony, I was asked to sit down. They said to me, do you do requests? I said, I do. They said, could you finish your act outside, please? We're wanting to get the comedian on. So there we are. It's wonderful. I went into the doctors. I said, can you help me out? He said, yes, of course. Which way did you come in? Uh, I agree, Scotty. Some presenters are good at reporting, but are not good at reading the news. Absolutely, Gordon. And, uh, you know, as you know, I don't wish to swell your head or embarrass you, but you were, uh, um, and probably are right now, a quite outstanding newsreader. And that's a skill in its own. So there we are. Uh, and that's what we're needing to do without the wells. And I'll tell you another one that uh, you might notice, Gordon. The smacking of the lips before speaking. So they say, so that's what's happening there, John. Well, thank you for that. You know, that's sort of idea, you know, it's, it's that kind of, that kind of nonsense that goes on, just a lot of palaver and trying to fill up the time. Well, I hope you all have a lovely weekend. The other one is a cheesy, a cheery, cheesy, oh, Freudian slip there, um, a cheery newscaster when it's a serious story, you know. Hello, there's been a bit of an accident tonight. And you think, just... Calm it down. And this voice is going up at the end of a sentence instead of down at the end of the sentence. There we are. Well, hello, you're back again, Scotty. Hope you are well. Oh, absolutely. Lovely to have you with us. And um, dinky-doo. Um, I'm on TikTok Live a lot, guys. So get yourselves on to TikTok at Scotty McClure. 
Also, please follow me on Twitter at Scotty McClure. But this is not a housekeeping ad for Scotty McClure. It's just to keep you up to date. And of course, there's the YouTube channel, Scotty McClure's YouTube channel. Um, I know from my media studies, reading the news is a different skill from being a DJ. I think you need to speak three words in a sentence as a DJ. Some poor DJs can't speak three words in a sentence. Uh, if you need any help on Facebook, I'd help you for free because you're a legend. Mark Schofield, you see the nicest things. I thank you. There we are, a legend in my own lunchtime. Although, I'll tell you what's very interesting. Gordon Ryder says, is that Fred Dibna in the picture in the background? Or you? Or the pub landlord? That's Lord Reith the Labrador at his graduation, and I went along with him. So there you are. Wonderful, wonderful chap. There we are. Very, very clever dog. So there we are. Very good. Um, first class honours in begging with his eyes. I have some of these biscuits. You know? So there are Fred Dibner I'm a huge fan of. I didn't get to meet him, but he was, of course, local. He was an Oldham man. Or was it Bolton? Bolton or Oldham? Might have been Bolton, I think. Fred, Fred was from, and of course a wonderful engineer, but I loved his programs and his humility when he used to say, hey, can I ever go at that, you know, with a blacksmith's hammer, a man that knew exactly what he was doing, wonderful, wonderful, and I loved when he brought the chimney down at exactly the right angle, it fell where he wanted it to fall, and he went, did you like that? <laughs> it's the 21st century. People don't realize how class you are. Hello to Jim, Stephen, Gibb, and Megs, says the wonderful Scott Fraser. I called you once but bottled it when they put me on. The Scott FM days. Andy Hegarty, uh, do come back on on the new phone-in and join us there. That will be wonderful. Guys, can everybody share this and let people know? I know it's a bit late on a Friday night. That'd be fabulous. I don't know if you can see that, if it's the wrong way around. Ah, that's the wrong way around, is it? Is that the wrong way around? Can somebody tell me if that's the wrong way around? You'll know what I mean by it. There we are. Mark Jupiter, good evening, Scotty, long time. Yes, I was just, um, I'd just come off TikTok. And I thought to myself, rather than switch everything off, somebody had sent through, so you can blame them, that sent through on my Facebook account, uh, Scotty, do you still do Facebook Live? And I thought, it's time for a pop-up to say hi to everybody. And Dinky do from Scotty McClure. And of course, I don't know if you can see this the right way around. Yes, it is the right way around. Excellent. Good. Well, in that case, do you remember the badges? The wee Scotty McClure badge. One of these went for £600 at a charity do. And this silly woman said, well, watch you don't end up with egg on your face. And they go for nothing. There were two of them. And they went for £600 each. The auctioneer said, and the next one. I won't mention the auctioneer. I won't embarrass him, but he's an absolute top auctioneer. Very, very well known. Uh, I meant no. Oh, no. It was the wrong way around. Ah, right. Well, they're all going, yes. Think you do. There's a wonderful Catherine Hasty. Think you do, Catherine. No, it's not the right way around. Right. Okay, okay. Can we get things the right way around on this? How would you do it? Which one do you flip? I don't want to touch anything in case I lose you all. You know, <laughs> is there a way of turning? You can flip the camera, but can you turn? Can you turn the mirroring on or off on Facebook? I don't know. Who knows their Facebook well enough? Give me some more thumbs up, guys, and a few hearts. Fantastic. And uh, no, it's not the right way around. Oh my goodness me! What have we done? There were water time. <clears throat> It's an age thing, the water is it. Gordon Riley's putting it the wrong way. Dinky do. The wrong way. That's the wrong way round, Gordon. You still do Twitch live. Uh, no, Louise, I haven't really done a lot with Twitch because what I was hoping to do, but my computer was too slow, as you know. Uh, I was hoping to do multi-streaming on all the platforms at the same time. Do you remember the phone in about law? Village, I do, Scott, 
Wonderful man. Was that you? Law Village Dinky Do, Scotty, says Robert Rovers. Robert Rovers, lovely to have you back with us. And a Dinky Do to you as well. All these fabulous people on here. Tremendous. And of course, if I'd spread the word, we could probably have got everybody on. That would have been the thing. Spread the word. Tell 10 to tell 10 to tell 10 about Scotty McClure popping up on Facebook just for you. Uh, Gordon, I do thoroughly enjoy seeing your posts on our uh, our old uh, firm site on the old uh, the old uh, site there. Fantastic. Yeah, so there we are. Love image. Yes, love image. Absolutely. I knew what you meant, Gordon. Yes, it was the wrong way around. <laughs> Wall Village. <laughs> I'm thinking our dear friend Sidney Devine, who passed away a week or two ago. Um, I'm just thinking, where was he from? He it wasn't Law Village, but it was from another one. And I noticed the news were reporting saying his funeral took place in his native Ayrshire. But I mean, he was from Lanarkshire, because I interviewed Sydney on BBC Radio Scotland. Tony says, you'd have to have the writing reverse the way around with the right way around the camera. It's like on police vans who have police written on the wrong way around. It's the right way around. And then, of course, I can't hit see more there. Can I risk it? See more. There we are. It's the right way around. Yeah, but they also have it in Gaelic. The police. The police. Camera. Ooh, hachimachi. Key de mille falci. Key de mille falci. Don. Facebook. Was very funny videos. Yes. Dinky do of the dinky variety. Nilo Gormley. I was thinking about you the other day. I saw Round Britain and they were talking about Dorset. And they were talking about Pooh. There we are. And somebody on social media was saying they were from Pooley in Dorset. Cleland! That's it, Beryl Vickers, you champion. It was a Cleland man. Yes, because I think he said his dad was a miner, if I remember. Looking very regal with the beard there, Scotty. We touch of the King Edward the Seventh. <laughs> I get it. Camera is the same as a person stood in front of you rather than a mirror. Yes, Mark, we have this on TikTok and I can put off the mirror and hold up a piece of writing and it makes absolute sense. But I don't know how you do the same on here. Also, YouTube has it the right way around. But for some reason, Facebook doesn't. So I'm just wondering if there's some facility that I've missed on Facebook that would allow me to do it. You can do a phone-in on Discord if you want to do those again. Aha! How would I do a phone-in, Louise, though? So there we are. I get it. So there we are. Yes, absolutely. Tremendous. Welcome, welcome. More people are joining us. I thank you. Remember seeing two of them in Carluke. <laughs> seeing the two of them in Carluke. Scott, absolutely, it's Carluke. We love Carluke. I uh, used to broadcast to Carluke. I saw a Polish police van saying Polis. I thought it was the Glasgow police. Now, there was a Polis is quite international, certain words in Gaelic. But do you not remember when they used to read the news in Gaelic? There's Josh, Josh Dinky Do. Hello from Scotty McClure and everybody live on Facebook just for you saying Dinky Do. Um, you know, there's these, do you remember when they used to read the news in Gaelic in the early days before we had an actual Gaelic channel? And they would, they would be doing the full Gaelic bit. I guess he ha ha he did a helicopter. And they would put in the odd English word, fantastic, a helicopter. And I remember sitting with, um, the Reverend John McLeod from Oban, who, along with Mary Sanderman, they wrote that lovely song, Give Me Your Hand. And um, they had a Gaelic version. And John and I were watching the news in Gaelic one night. And I said, John, do you understand him in Gaelic as well as I would understand in English? And he said, oh, better. Find me on Facebook, I'll help you with your live sessions. Mark Scofield, thank you very much indeed. 
Play to Discord and share the link with callers. Everyone can wait in a queue and you pick who to talk to. I shall look into that, Louise, because I have uh, downloaded Discord. Uh, so I just need to work out how to use it. Oh, this is the thing. <laughs> Everything should be interchangeable on the internet, and then you just go on the one channel. But I do think TikTok may well be the new television. The only thing is I get quite a few trolls on at first because they're used to dealing at a very low level in junk. And when something big comes on that's a bit classy, uh, like Scotty McClure, then they're a bit phased, but we, we deal with them. So there we are. I remember watching the Gaelic children's program, Dotterman. The best bit at the end was said to him when they said, Cheery, cheery, absolutely, Coasheen. Uh, uh, Rose is watching, Dinky Doodles. Lovely to have you with us, and welcome, welcome, welcome. Happy to help if you need it. Louise, you're an outstanding lady. Thank you very much. Always appreciate it. There we are. Because about McClure, uh, you know, no matter what age I am, I'm always learning. Every day's a school day, I see. So there you are. But I do need to... Um, I think I might speak to the news, the television news companies, and say, do you want me to come in? for a couple of hours a week, and train your newscasters to do a better job. There we go. Wonderful stuff. Now, how long have I been up here? Scotty, did you ever look at my Elf of Balfron on YouTube? Gordon, eh, I shall put that on the list and have a wee look. There is so much to watch. I think one of the reasons that I don't get the massively huge numbers I used to on social media is because there's so much media, you know? When I was a child, we had a television that received one channel, the BBC. Yeah, the BBC. And, um, you know, that was one channel. And then we used to be able to go upstairs to our neighbours to see associated rediffusion with Robin Hood. And um, I think that would have been the early days of Scottish television. So there you are. And they would be putting that out. And the television closed down. They opened up at lunchtime and then closed down and then opened up in the evening again about 5 o'clock. And I can remember people saying, ah, it's television time then, you see. And uh, I used to get that when I first started doing evening shows on the radio. People say, nobody will be listening to that. That's television time. Of course, we picked up about a quarter of a million a half hour. <laughs> the minute you stop learning, you stop living. Twenty, I could not agree more. So there we go. Yes, get the knuckleheads on all the platforms, Scotty. Train them to tell the truth. Good media production. That's what we're needing, Gordon. Good media production. And I know Gordon Roddick will back me on this. Yes, you're good at spotting a halfway on TikTok, sir. Well, there we are. Thank you very much, Jim Stephen Gibb, for all your support. Giving your age away, Scotty. I know, Mark, I am 32. I don't mind who knows it. So there we are. I'm from Lanark, says Scott. Listen, I don't think anybody heard that. I'll not let it on. <laughs> we love Lanark. Only teasing, Scott. Wonderful part of the world. Lanark, of course. And Lanamore Day. Uh, LMAO says Mark Dinky Do. So there they are, fantastic. Just for you. Right, uh, I suppose it's time I wasn't here. Been lovely, lovely, lovely being with you all again. Thank you for coming and joining me. Remember to share this. Because uh, the problem with one or two platforms, you used to get thousands when you popped up, and now they only show it to a few people. So there you go. I saw one the other day and it said, um, 12 people have seen this. I thought, whoa, you were better shouting out the window half the time. But that's just because, again, as we were saying, 
There's so much media. Tony says, I think Scotland should be proud of Nicola Sturgeon, especially at the inquiry. What do you think? Well, I shan't comment on that, Tony, until we see what the outcome was. But it was certainly quite an ordeal. Can't wait to see your show again. Absolutely, Louise, and it will happen. Lovely to talk to you all. Thank you for joining us. Take great care of your dear selves. Stay fabulous and stay safe. Uh, good night. Uh, keep in touch. Keep in touch. Thank you, Mark. Shall I sing you the goodbye song for old time's sake? Goodbye, everybody. Goodbye. Take care, everybody, as you go. Goodbye, everybody. A vita saint. Au revoir and a cheery o. Take care of yourselves, my dears, as we're saying the best of circles. Dinky-doo and ta-ra, lads! <laughs>